What is up guys? Gaming Bro Jake here, bringing you guys a 2-in-1 video actually. Uh, today I'm going to show you my new laptop setup. I know it's been a couple of weeks, but basically what I do is HDMI out to this amazing TV. But um, yeah, today I'm going to show you how to get Clash of Clans on a uh, laptop. This is uh, yeah, the Windows 8.1. And, uh, basically, yeah, let's get started. Um, how this runs, it's an Android emulator, so I'm going to give you the download for that. Basically, it's something called BlueStacks. Now, to find that, you're going to go to Internet Explorer. And then what you're going to do is type in bluestacks.com. Okay, now it's going to load up here. And actually their headline for this is play Clash of Clans on your PC. Now this is for basically any Android app. I will say that. They also have Candy, Cra Candy Crush, Instagram. But basically it supports all the way back to um, Windows XP. So um, you can get it for all these platforms, and yeah, that's BlueStacks, guys. Now what you're going to do when you open up BlueStacks, which I'm opening that up right now, it'll say initializing. Now I'm going to be honest with you guys, this is a, it is sometimes laggy and buggy, but um, if you work with it, it will pay you back, because I find playing Clash of Clans with a mouse a lot more effective and more accurate, because... I did actually do an attack earlier with the mouse, and yeah, I fared pretty well. I mean, I two-starred somebody in Silver League 2, and I just started playing this game maybe two weeks ago. But basically, here you go, to the storefront. Um, you can see they advertise a lot of apps. And uh, I'm going to click on WhatsApp, because I don't have that. If I would have clicked on Clash of Clans, it would have put me in the app. But um, this actually is the full Play Store. That's why I say Android Emulator because it's yeah that it's just that it's every single android app you could want all right i'm going to go to the store home not give out any names or emails here and uh you can go to games top free yeah i just find this pretty awesome you can access the entire android store on your laptop this can be 64 bit 32 bit and I mean, as long as you have a quad-core, dual-core PC, everything will run smooth. But the reason I primarily got this is to play Clash of Clans, because my primary phone, the Galaxy Centaur, is only 3.5 inches, and it does get pretty annoying playing Clash of Clans on that. So I thought playing it on this would be more effective. And yeah, that's basically that. So now I'm going to go back to... Um, what I'm going to do now is... Close the app so you can see it's Android. And close the app like that. And then it'll kick you back to your main screen. And I'm going to click on Clash of Clans. Now, I'm not going to promise that this is going to load. It might glitch up and make the same noise effects over and over again. Because it's done that before where the supercell comes up. But basically what it will do is prepare app for use. It'll say like analyzing and all that. But um, when you do get this to work, yeah, you can see me there. Um, it is very worth it, so to say. And, um, yeah, there you go, Supercell. It actually did load the very first time. That never happens for me. So, um, yeah, I'll crank the volume back up and give you guys a quick tour. As you can see, there's my mouse on the purple. But, um, yeah, well, that's loading up. It does take a little bit to load. This is my primary setup. I have the 360 sitting over here, my Turtle Beach and all that down there, and I got this new office chair, which I like a lot, and I got a new stand. The old one is sitting over there. I just like this one because you can get closer to your TV, and I double this as a monitor for my laptop and a uh, TV for my console. Also, this down here points to shop. Uh, I actually got this HDMI cable for free from them a while ago. You should definitely check that site out. They do give out free stuff. I got that mouse pad for free, obviously. So it says points to shop on it.
But also, another thing of this video, Kevin and I, Gaming Bro Shafe, the proper term, we just made a new clan called Project Gaming. Now, if you guys want to watch, watch this. It is open. Anyone can join. We just made this clan, like, maybe ten minutes ago, so we only have three members in there, but I'm Gettys101, he's Shafe. We'll give his, uh village a quick visit but if you do want to join our clan you definitely are welcome to and uh yeah that's his clan you can see he's up there he has level 10 cannons level 7 laboratory 7 walls archer towers he has a level 8 one going up to 9 he's a wizard tower at level 5 um, yeah, he's pretty good at this game. I, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not that good at all But you can see we just created this clan ten minutes ago. It's saying so it's pretty accurate We're gonna return home though. You can see mine. I'm only town hall level five and I plan to stay that way so that I can max out my town hall and then uh, upgrade I find it stupid if you only have what level four walls and a level eight town hall i mean yeah it's just unreasonable guys but um anyway yeah this is my place but um i'm gonna show you you can also play this just like a regular android tablet because i do have a touchscreen asus transformer book um yeah this is a lot better than the phone guys i'll quick load it up on the phone just to demonstrate um It'll boot this off because I'm connecting on another device. You'll see in a minute. But, um. Yeah, the, it runs okay on this phone. This phone obviously loads a lot faster because it's authentic Android. This is just an emulator. Yeah, connection lost. Another device is connecting. So I'm connecting on this device. And you can see there's my village. So, yeah, there you go, guys. I hope my tutorial was useful to you guys. Once again, this does not apply just to Clash of Clans. This applies to any Android app you want to run. You can run Facebook for Android if you wanted to on this thing. Um, you can get the default browser, and you can really just get any application in the Google Play Store using this method on a desktop PC or a laptop, whatever you want to call it. Just basically a Windows PC. So anyway guys, thanks for watching, we're coming up on that 100 video mark, and I decided to make a long video for today because we appreciate all the support that we've been given, 36 subscribers is a lot for a channel like us, and yeah guys, as always, game on, and I hope that you end up using this emulator, because it is very good, it's free, and for the most part, it is stable, you just gotta work with it a little bit, but yeah. Game on, guys.